It's time to react. What's going on, YouTube? What's going on, YouTube? YouTube. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Brad Still Channel, Still Reactions. Yatta is where it's happening. Thank you guys for joining me on the Bradical Bandwagon. It is Super Bowl Sunday. And yes, all of our lives would be better if the Tennessee Titans were playing in the Super Bowl tonight. But alas, once again, they are not. So we will settle for the Bengals and the Rams, won't we? Uh, but today, in honor of Super Bowl Sunday, I'm going and checking out what I believe was the first uh, big time Super Bowl halftime show. Correct me if I'm wrong. I could be very wrong about that, but I think this was the first time they ever had like a major artist come in for the Super Bowl halftime show, and it is the great King of Pop, Michael Jackson, 1993, I believe, maybe 1994, 1993. So I was not even born. So uh, I was not even in the world yet, but this is Michael Jackson, one of the all-time greats. This is what I'm checking out in honor of Super Bowl Sunday. Hey, uh, some of my covers and original music are on the channel. Here's a snippet. Singing Nickelback karaoke and laughing until we were sore. Some of the best memories I've ever made were on days when I was bored. If you want to hear that full song, it's on Spotify, it's on Apple, it's anywhere you get your music. And the music uh, video link will be at the end of this video as well as in the video description below. Also, the red subscribe button is below. I'm trying to get to 150K. You can help me get there if you're watching right now and you're not subscribed. It takes one second to click the red subscribe button if you enjoy the channel. And then it's done. You're a subscriber for right now. The great Michael Jackson Super Bowl halftime show 1993. Hitting play right now. There he is. That is so cool. Ooh, he's gonna come out of every screen. Kind of feels like he's playing the thriller. There he is. Oh, look at the reaction of the people. They are losing their minds. They have lost all control at this point. I mean, when you think about artists that could elicit emotion from a crowd, I mean, you're talking about, like, he is in very elite company. You're probably talking about, like, him, Elvis, and the Beatles, right? I mean, like, him, Elvis, Beatles, who else? I mean, there were people jumping up and down where they stood when he popped up from under that stage. <laughs> Cameo by Troy Aikman there. Oh. <laughs> the statue. He's going to do like one subtle movement and they're going to lose their minds. I could already tell. How long is he going to stand there? There it is. I knew it was going to be something subtle. How long is he this one? There we go. There 
There it is. Ah. Look at the big Listen, can you imagine how groundbreaking this had to be back then to have not just a halftime show, but to have the literal top music act, musical act in the world and one of the top musical acts of all time. Like you're here for a football game and oh yeah, by the way, in addition to watching the Cowboys and the Bills in the Super Bowl, you don't get to watch the greatest entertainer of all time. I mean, geez. <laughs> Look at his feet. Amazing. Uh oh. You know what time it is. Give it to me. I know it's so simple, but that guitar riff has always been one of It's so simple, but like whenever I'm listening to this song in the car or something and that guitar riff starts up, I'm just like, oh, come on now. It's so funky. And Michael Jackson is like an entertainer's entertainer. Good Lord. Oh, It's amazing to compare this to Super Bowl halftime shows now, and I don't have anything against the Super Bowl halftime shows now, but you know, now Super Bowl halftime shows are like so extravagant and there's so many different things that they do to put it over the top. But this is so early in the process that like it's literally a fog machine is like their biggest special effects, you know, and like Back then, it was like they just, they just sent Michael Jackson out there and were like, hey, entertain the people. We don't have any, like, great special effects that we can do because it's only 1993. So if you could just go out there and, and make this worth the people's time. And, of course, they picked a great person to go out there and do that. <laughs> just moves 
so freely. I think it's about time for him to slow it down a little bit, right? Lord, he's rocking out right now. Michael was never afraid to just let the moment sit. Let him cheer for the while. Have created their own personal drawings as a gift to the children of the world. What is that? Is that a wand? How do they get the crowd to participate in this? Today, we stand together all around the world, joined in a common purpose to remake the planet into a haven of joy and understanding and goodness. Man, in so many ways, it felt like he was ahead of his time. I can't, I can't really tell, uh, in terms of the message that, that he's given out here, I can't really tell if he's ahead of his time or if just this message is always going to be relevant. But uh, I love stopping in the middle of the halftime show to give a speech like this. It's great. No one should have to suffer, especially our children. This time, we must succeed. This is for the children of the world. There's a place in your heart, and I know that it is love. And this place be much brighter than tomorrow. Try, you'll find there's no need to cry. This is a great song. In this place, you feel there's no hurt or sorrow. There are ways to get there. Ooh. If you care enough for the living, make a little space, make a better place. In the world, make oh, that, a better place. that little kid got in his way. I had to politely move it. You know, Michael Jackson gets so much credit for his uh, like fast songs like Beat It and Billie Jean and stuff like that, and he deserves that, but... Man, he had some great ballads. This one, Man in the Mirror, ooh. I feel you are all my brothers. Create a world with no fear. Together we'll cry happy tears. So the nations turn their swords into plowshares. We could really get there if you cared enough. 
<laughs> he got that kid's attention just to give him a peace sign. Nice key change. Take it up again. Man, what I love about it is it sticks out is how simple this halftime show is. I mean, especially like I said, when you compare with today's Man, it's there's just something beautiful about just that simple let the entertainer go out and entertain and then end it with some of the heartfelt, meaningful stuff and the globe coming out of I mean, it's crazy. In ninety three, people are probably sitting there going, Wow, like that is amazing. Look did you they're calling their friends like, Hey, do you you see the globe on the Michael Jackson after I'm sure that's that's unbelievable. Now, if they did that in a halftime show, it'd be like, this is the stupidest thing I've ever seen. Oh, let's finish it. Well, I mean, I think it's fitting if that is indeed the first major halftime show like that that was ever done. I mean, it is appropriate that it would start with Michael Jackson. I mean, you know, you want to set the bar early. I mean, man, think about what he started there. I mean, that's, you know, now for years we've seen some incredible, incredible halftime shows and he was the one who started it. Uh, I, th I thought it was really good. I mean, hitting, you know, all of his hits as much as you can. And, of course, as many hits as he had. Of course, you're not going to be able to work them all in there. But uh, I liked kind of ending with that subdue, you know, the We Are the World and Heal the World. I liked ending with that. And, and I appreciate the fact that he did because he has so many upbeat uh, songs that he could have ended with any litany of things. But I liked that he ended with a positive message like that. And, man, great halftime show. Unbelievable entertainer, one of the greatest, if not the greatest ever. Thank you guys for joining me on the Radical Bandwagon. Have fun watching the Super Bowl tonight. Uh, the covers and original music of mine, some of that should be on your screen as well as in the video description below. And the red subscribe button is below. Wish you would check that out too. Thank you guys. Happy Super Bowl Sunday. Take it in, soak it up. Bye.